Good morning. How we doing out there around the world? Okay. Let me know if you can hear me. It's sounding a little quiet on my end. I don't know what that's about. Good morning. Um, I barely made it. I'll be frank. I did not quite hear the alarm like I should have, so I am just rolling in here to the studio. Different location because we got a bunch of boxes. Can you hear me? Because the audio on my end does not quite sound right. Um, anyway, good morning. Hey, Jordan, you're probably happy, right? Jordan's going to be first on the screen. Good to see you, Jordan, from Singapore. What time is it in Singapore? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. 5.30 a.m., baby. Come on. We're not messing around, Steve. All right, let's go, let's go. Good to see everyone. Hello, DGR from snowy Germany. Mm, I heard about the snow. And sorry about the hair. I'm just rolling. We're rolling out of bed this morning, so uh, I'll probably have to get a hat on here in a minute. Uh, it sounded like you got over a foot of snow in Germany. Is that right? Okay, Jason says audio is good. That's interesting. All right, that's good. I don't know. It sounds a little quiet. Maybe it's just, uh, I don't know what's going on with these headphones, but good, good, good. Glad you can hear me. Good to see everybody. Oh, man. I'm recovering, waking up. The legs are still barking at me pretty good. Early in Colorado, Seth. That's right. We uh, we got we got things to do. We got things to do on this earth. Audio is good. Thank you, Wilson. Appreciate you uh, for being here, Wilson. Very, very good. Keen is here. And, of course, let us know where you're watching from around the world. Hope you're doing well. If you're watching this on replay, we are opening boxes today all right and yes this connects to running shoe reviews in fact um you know maybe i'll just kick it off right now what is your <laughs> this is a big question what is your hope and desire for this youtube channel and shoe reviews what is your hope and desire for this youtube channel and running shoe reviews all right you can mull it over but for everybody that's watching this on replay and wants to reply down below in the comments that is cool as well and uh let's let's get it going though first with a little little global all right come on i always love like we already had singapore in the house good good wilson from brazil it's 9 30 a.m very cool I know it's interesting. Yeah, that's great. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Wilson, for being here. See, Jordan is from Singapore. Actually, Jordan. Yeah. I got your I got you. You know what? It's sitting right there, sir. It's on its way today. All right. It's heading out. Um mm -hmm. Oh, that's interesting. Are you serious? Jordan does I I didn't know this, everybody. Who else is waiting for Berlin results? Okay. Who else is waiting for Berlin results? Very interesting. I didn't know. Um, that was today. Sam, good morning from Tennessee. Good to see you, Sam. Rotterdam. Oh, my goodness. Ingrid. That's awesome. Ah, oh, cheers to um, cheers to everybody in the Netherlands. Special place in my my running heart because I've I've raced two of my marathons in your country and it's a beautiful country so amsterdam and rotterdam thank you ingrid for tuning in do appreciate it tuning in from tejas Ayo, very very good it's probably about 6 30 a.m there depending on where you're at maybe um very cool um mm -hmm. let's go let's go um let's see uh, i'm just trying to What's up? Good morning, Forrester D. What's up, Andy? Good to see you, sir. Do appreciate you. Uh, Andy has his own YouTube channel, everybody. You should go check it out. Uh, Forrest of Dean Runner. Great runner. Great man over in the UK. Always working hard. Appreciate you. Good morning, Steve. What's going on? Uh, what's, what's good from the sunshine state oh man steve the man steve the man okay we got uh ooh, is that mm, i want to say maybe oh see i always get in trouble um not the czech republic oh, what country i'm sorry I, I the flag looks so small on my screen i can't quite see the emblem on the inside but um sam 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 okay so um Catman do. Oh my goodness. That's amazing. 
Good evening from Kathmandu. See, we're getting some some new viewers, and uh, I think I am gonna grab. I'm just waking up. I literally like the the alarm went off, but I didn't I didn't really hear it. It's kind of a newer phone, so I'm still getting used to how the alarm works. And I don't know what happened. I don't know. So the fact that I'm here right now is a little bit of a miracle. And um, but I appreciate all of you tuning in. But the fact that I'm going live so early in the morning, it's cool because people on the other side of the world, it's evening. And like, I don't think we've ever had anybody tune in from Kathmandu. So that's pretty cool. So um, good. To, good to see you there. And speaking of which, yes, we are going to be opening up running shoes today just so you know we got a lot of boxes this is going to be a really 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 long live stream actually um because i'm going to open up all the boxes literally live right here okay so if you need to go uh drop the kids off at school and then come back i will still probably be live not not kidding um and again uh, I asked this a minute ago, and thanks for hitting that like button on the on the way in. Is that um, obviously the channel? I took a break, took that siesta. It was very nice to uh, take a little time off. And but of course, you know the running shoe companies still wanted me to do shoe reviews, but I was on a break. So all these boxes behind me are from the break this summer, and. So, I'm in catch-up mode, but as I asked a minute ago, what is your hope and desire for running shoe reviews on this YouTube channel? Okay, what do you think, what are you hoping for? And just share in the comments, share in the live stream, whatever you want to do. Um, I don't know, I, I have ideas on how, on what I'll be doing moving forward with shoe reviews, and I'm looking up here because I have a new calendar on my wall for 2024. So we're all preparing for 2024. It's not too, too far off, you know, and so I'm strategizing and thinking, okay, what is it going to look like for shoe reviews in the future? So anyway, it's time. There's so many boxes that I just need to open them in one push rather than over a couple of videos or whatever. So we're just going to, we're going to knock out a lot of shoes and I have no idea. I really have no idea what is in these sh in these boxes. So we're about to find out together. But first, a few more folks. Good morning, Ben. Good to see you, Ben. Good morning, Meredith. Oh, I know. wow. It's early, Meredith, for you especially. That's great. Good to see you. Um, hello from Norway. Steven's in the house. Good to see you. Thanks for tuning in. Um, oh, there we go. Mark says, I've got eyes on Berlin Lottery 2. I'm over eight for Berlin, so not holding my breath. Interesting. Wow, you keep trying though, and that's what that's what counts, Mark. Um, okay, as we keep going here, so, mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, let's see. Warm Island greetings from AJ. Very very good, and um, you know I often ask like what what was your run today, but. I'm going to ask instead, um, since we're talking about Berlin, but what is your next race? Okay, we'll get a little get a little butter on the screen. Come on now. Let's get a little butter. All right. What is your next race going to be? All right. And as you answer that, I'm going to go get a hat for my, you know, usually I uh, get a haircut before my races and for CIM. And if you want to ask me anything about CIM, go for it. I'd be happy to answer, even though I, I did a live stream a couple days ago about CIM. Um, but if you want to ask any questions, go for it. And But usually I get a haircut, and but I literally like, ran out of time. And I was going to get it in Sacramento, ran out of time between the group run. Oh, man, come on. Here it is, in case you missed it. There's a picture from the group run in Sacramento. There's some of the crew. Here's, um, hold on, not that... Um, Hold on. Uh, where is it? There we go. I think there it is. Oh, just an epic group run. So, so good to see everybody out there. Oh, it was a lot of fun. So if you missed, if you missed um, the 
vlogs and the live streams from the past couple of days. We were in Sacramento, California for CIM, and um, I'm still hobbling around like a like an old man that I am. All right, so there's the bib number. Good, good day, fun day, hard day, but fun, as it uh, sometimes turns into in long distance running. Erlinger Chattanooga half marathon for Jason. Okay. All right, I'm going to let this breathe for a second. Hold on. I can walk, but barely. Okay. All right. Butter, butter, butter. Uh-huh. Cheers. By the way, new mugs. New mugs arrive. A little uh, Irish lily pad green. Don't mind if I do. Mm-hmm. So, thanks for tuning in, everybody. Hello, hello. Mm-hmm. Um, let's see. Okay, Elisio says, getting ready for a 10K uh, Carrera del Pavo Turkey Road race in Progreso, Yucatan, Mexico next weekend. Very good. You are, man, there's a lot of races where you live because you are always racing. And I com I applaud you for uh, getting out there, man. You are, he crushes this gentleman, everybody. He is doing really, really good things down in Mexico. Uh, 3M half in ATX downhill to downtown, baby. Um, in ATX. Is that um, is that Austin, I'm guessing? Austin, Texas. Very cool. Very exciting. Marco, next race, Winter Birch Trail, 42K, uh, 12th of February. Very good. So I guess I'll tell you mine is going to be, I should make a graph. Actually, it might be on here. Where is it racing? Mm. Oh boy. Um, gosh, we had some graphics up at some point, but it's not working at the moment. Hold on, let's just see. Yeah, that's okay. Anyway, we had some um, we had uh, some graphics at, at one point. So, Oh, all right. Should we open the first box? Might as well. Oh, man. Okay. Ugh. Okay. So, again, getting back into, we got the knife, the blunt knife. Um, getting back into, <laughs> I'm laughing about what we had talked about in um, Sacramento. The knife came up. We had a party afterward. It was fun. Um, at a restaurant, little uh, hangout, and the uh, the unboxing uh, knife came up. For those that don't know, um, this knife was made by my high school buddy. So he's a he's a hunter, so elk hunting, deer hunting, and he made this knife. So anyway, it's near and dear to my heart. Okay, here we go. So again, this is a, a live running shoe unboxing. I need to unbox as many shoes as possible today. It's gonna We're going to be here for, we might be here for hours. I'm not kidding. So if you want to go get your run in and come back, or <laughs> go for it. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Christina, what's up? Good to see you. Oh my goodness. Kareem, good to see you. Good to see everybody. Appreciate you all. Um... Oh my goodness, it was just wild, wild, wild group, Simon. Um, how about your legs now after CIA? Hey, they're very sore still. Yesterday was probably the worst, and today they um I got down the stairs a little easier. So that's good. Okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ayo. Uh -huh. Ayo. Okay. This one opened up on its own. That's nice. Uh -huh. Butter to the bread. Mmm, the Hyperion Max, very good. Okay, there it is. Hyperion Max from Brooks, very nice. Ooh, nice. That's exciting. And listen, I realize like most of these shoes have already been released. And so I'm like way behind the curve and doesn't matter to me. It's okay. Um, so 
Um, you know, I know a lot of you watch the YouTube channel for the shoe reviews, which is fine. It's um, it's amazing in in Sacramento, the amount of people that I probably talked to a hundred people one on one before the race, after the race, and a majority of them said the reason we watch your channel is because of the family. Like we love to see your family. And I was like, it was like 70% of the people said that to me. And then maybe 20% said, Seth, we need a new running shoe matrix. Uh, because they they watch for the running shoe reviews, which is amazing. And then maybe the last 10% was, you know, I just I just watched for everything, you know, racing, all of it. So I do realize there is a segment of DGR that does appreciate the running shoe reviews. Um, but anyway, for everyone that did come up and share with me in Sacramento, like why they watch, it helps. So I have not got forgotten about shoe reviews, but I took a break, took a siesta. Oh my, my, wow. Catamount too. Very, very zesty. Mm hmm. Trail shoe from Brooks. Very nice. That's nice. I'm not doing a ton of trail running right now. But I will. Okay. Uh huh. Oh my goodness. Okay. So I'll continue to monitor the comments. Keep them coming. Um. Let's go. Let's go. If you're just joining us, welcome. We're doing a running shoe unboxing, and yes, we are live on Facebook. Actually, let's get our first Facebook in. Come on now, Justin. There we go. What's up, Justin? Good to see you. David says, next race, my first 50K Ultra Trail, Ultra at the Dead Sea on, oh, wow, February 2nd. Waiting to hear Berlin as well. Very good. Um, Victoria, uh, what shoes are you most excited for? Nova Blast 4. I mean, yeah. You know, I got to say, the original Nova Blast still has my heart, though. I got I to gotta tell you that much right now. <clears throat> Okay. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Oh man. We are gonna have so many boxes in here. Okay. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> Another pair of supernovas. Um, I actually did do an unboxing a couple days ago, and um, these were in there. So I'm not sure what's going on, Adidas, but thank you, Supernovas. All right, there you go. All right, very cool. Very, very cool. Okay, 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 okay. Let's keep rolling here. Let's keep rolling. Keep the questions coming too, everybody. Come on now, don't be shy. Don't be shy now. I will, uh, I'll keep working through. We're just gonna go one box at a time, make it happen here. All right. Mm -hmm. And I know, like some of these are, some of these are exciting shoes. Some of these shoes maybe aren't as exciting, but I know, uh, like this one. Well, this one's from the UK, I think. Oh no! Just oh my goodness! Wow! Oh my goodness! Some of the companies are very obscure. Okay, come on now, Tarkine. Okay, yes, I think Australia maybe. Um, a trail shoe. Whoa. I, I want to say Australia. I'm not positive on that, but Tarkine, T-A-R-K-I-N-E. Okay, there you go. A wider forefoot. Very cool. All right. And if you're just joining us, thanks for tuning in. Thanks for hitting that like button on the way in. We're having a good old time here. Opening up running shoes. Uh-oh, but this says US 9. That's not going to work, but I'll give those away. Okay. Onward and upward. All right, let's go. Carl says, my next race is also here in your Chattanooga Half Marathon. Waiting on Chicago news tomorrow. is Wow. Tomorrow is, is Chicago? Oh, my goodness. That's exciting. It's, all these dates. It's unbelievable. Um, let's see. Eric, good to see you, Eric. I'll echo others and just encourage you to review the shoes that excite you or excite or scare you. Most shoes are in the middle average. So we would most benefit from knowing about shoes to get or avoid. Onward. There you go. I appreciate that, Eric. That's a good sentiment right there. Very, very good. 
Okay. Mm -hmm. Very good. Mm -hmm. Mm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Doo -doo -doo. So, what's everyone drinking this morning? I got my dark black coffee here. Ugh. Okay. A little New Balance action. In fact, I'm going to take a sip. Ah, okay, from Poland, good to see you from Poland, uh, a meter of snow there, had to tempo run because there are on conditions at all to do that, yeah, I heard you guys got the snow, I mean, I, I kind of I kinda like snowstorms, like big ones that, I don't know, it's just fun, at least it's fun for the kids, you know, fun for sledding and getting out there obviously it does make the running more difficult so i get it then uh, darwin is here um happy holidays good morning seth currently waiting for berlin okay man we should have had a berlin watch party i guess we're doing it right now i guess we're doing it right now everybody a little berlin watch party for the lottery let's let's just turn this into a berlin watch party i mean you're probably the fourth or fifth person that's that's um that's that's just great. Okay, here we go. Trail. Oh my goodness, this is fun. Oh yeah. Oh my goodness, the super comp trail. That is fun. Wow. Very, very cool. Vibram on the outsole, traction, light base. And before I forget, um, oh man, that is fun. See, here's the deal, everybody. My fun. This summer, and thank you all, 130 plus folks tuning in. Thanks for hitting the like button. Let the rest of DGR know that we are live in the studio at 5.56 a.m. My type of fun is running FKTs in the mountains all summer, and that's what I did. I went crazy. I think we snagged 18 FKTs in the Colorado Rockies this summer, 18, and usually I only get like three or four because it's a hard, hard effort, and you have to recover from it. Because of that, I I said no to the shoe reviews all summer. Like this shoe, actually, I wish I would have known was in that pile, but that's okay. I would prefer, I would rather go get FKTs all summer than do shoe reviews. And that's what I did. And um, But guess what? We're coming back. And so I keep asking, and I'll ask again, What's your hope for the shoe reviews on the channel? Um, so, yeah, what's the hope for the shoe reviews on the channel? So, thank you for for stopping by on this morning. We're just opening boxes, everybody. Just opening lots of boxes, okay? So, keep the questions coming. I'm going to keep unboxing. I'm just monitoring as much as I can here. There we go. There's DDR. And... Um, there was one that I missed, though. Mm -hmm -hmm. I'm just... Dun -dun. Oh, my goodness. Having dinner here in Hong Kong while watching you French duck and salad in the house. That's awesome. That sounds fun. French duck. Wow. That sounds really good. Um, I've never... I don't know if I've ever had duck. Um, so, I do want to give a shout out, though, to all before i forget the new channel members thank you for becoming members of the channel all right do appreciate you you help keep these lights on here in the studio by your support all right that's no joke okay here we go mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. oh see this gets this actually gets me even more excited <laughs> Because, wow, this is cool. Because this is not. Wow. An on puffy jacket. Oh, my goodness. The climate jacket. Oh, my. What's it called? Yeah, the climate jacket. Very cool. It's like a moss color. Very cool. I must say, on is making a pretty big push, everybody. Watch out. On is making. I'm still not like over the moon on all their shoes but in the apparel outerwear space whoa whoa like i can just tell i can just tell that they nailed this um i haven't even worn it but that it's not too 
too thick. A lot of, you know, I like, I don't like to be cold when I run. I, I actually despise, I, I do not like to be cold. And so I can tell that they, but then you don't want to overheat either. So I can tell like they're really engineering this nicely. Very interesting. So thank you on. Okay. Man, it's really nice. I don't have to stand up too, too much right now. Um, I am very, very sore, everybody. Okay, David's in the house. Gosh, it's been a while. Thanks for being here, man. I, I missed, missed seeing your little little profile picture and crazy amount of snow in Latvia as well. Impossible to run at faster pace. Wow. Is this, this, is, is, this is a big storm for you guys. Germany, Latvia, Poland. Um man i'm glad i hope um yeah i just um yeah anyway so I, I hope you're i hope you guys are okay but at the same time um it is christmas time so i guess maybe that's a white christmas right um do 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 um okay New Hope says, do you think there will be a Glide Ride 4? It's by far the best shoe for me, and I can not find any 2s or 3s since they're really old. Interesting. Yeah. It was, it's it's a unique shoe. I really liked the Glide Ride. Um, yeah, I really did like the Glide Ride lineup, and I'm not saying I don't like it now, but um, it's a unique shoe. I liked it, you know, for long runs when I maybe wanted a little bit of help, and... It's a little, you know, it's a heavier shoe, but I really enjoyed, I, I really enjoyed the Glide Ride. Um, so I'm not sure, I, I don't have any answers for you on that. Maybe somebody else knows, um, will there be a Glide Ride 4? I just don't, I just don't know. I just don't know. Nope. Not gonna go. There we go. So. Uh, uh, okay. What do you got here? Ah. Oh. Shout out to all the stability runners out there. Stability runners. All right. All right. Oh, yeah. Let me just go over to Discord. We alive and awake in Discord. Yes, we are alive. Any questions in Discord? Um, not sure if Seth meant to schedule at 5.30 a.m. his time, but I'm on. Phil. I'm on, Phil. Come on, Phil. Phil's over in Discord. Coffee and shoes, as Jeremy said. Let's go. Let's go. I hope you're here, Phil. Tuning in. Yes, I meant to do 5.30 a.m., and we are live. See, what's nice about a peak race being in the background? So this is a stability shoe from New Balance, the Vongo. Okay, is this the V6? Yes, V6. Wow. Um, now, uh, raise your hand. Do you need a stability shoe or neutral shoe? Stability shoe, any, who, any stability shoe runners out there? So, uh-huh. Mm -hmm. What's been your most memorable race? Oh my goodness. Whoa. What's been your most memorable race? Oh my my. Um hmm. Oh my. <laughs> Whoa. That's like a that's a lot of racing, Logan. Um, oh boy. Okay. We're doubling up. All right. Hyperion Max again. All right. So we'll give that pair away. That we already got that one, everybody. And we already opened it. If you're just joining us, welcome. Welcome. Brent, what's going on, Brent? Good to see you. Yes, yeah, still here, says Bill. Okay. Yeah, come on now. Come on. Yeah, what I was about to say is that um with CIM in the background, in you know it's um, it's done. And let me just switch this up real quick to some of our longest standing channel members. Thank you. Since we're talking about Discord, is um, I'm ready to work. I don't know. It was a good break. Then Pike's Peak. Then launching the store, which is behind me. You can see behind me. And then um, and then CIM. And it's just like one thing after another, after another. And so I am just like, chill. I'm like, I'm ready to work. We're ready to work, Phil. 
and and not necessarily in the running space. Okay, not um, not running 140 miles a week, if you know what I mean. All right, Adrian is here from Toledo. Um, okay, Logan, I'm gonna tell you the day that I walked onto the CU cross country team is probably the most memorable race. All right, I was not very fast in high school, and that's okay. Logan just asked this a minute ago, and I there's so many I could give you so many answers, but I'm gonna say the day I walked onto the CU cross country team, pretty big deal because they were national champions the year before. So there you go, Logan. Okay, if you're just joining us, welcome. Uh, let's see. How many folks are tuning in now? 133. Nice. I appreciate you. Oh, man. Can we break? Can we break 150 this morning? Can we break 150? Cheers, everybody. We're just having some some hangout time, opening shoes. And um, <laughs> does the is the research team in Discord ready for uh, ready, ready for some research? Um, it, here's it's like, you know. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Shoe reviews, shoe reviews. I, it's so funny for me. Like I, the shoes are fine, but it's like such a small, um, percentage of the joy that I find from running. Like it's like very small that I just don't get as excited about shoes as a lot of people. And that's what, but I, but I, it's okay. We're all different. We're made different, right? And so some people really love shoe reviews and like they love the the science behind the shoe design and all of that. And for me, it's um, it doesn't light my fire as much as um, some other things in the running world. Not saying they're not important, but it's just not as zesty in my heart, if you know what I mean, for shoes and shoe reviews. And that's okay. That's okay. We're all different. We all get excited for different reasons. Amber, I see you in Discord. Good to see you, Amber. Um, okay. If I'm missing some questions, do apologize. What's up, Kevin? Good to see you. Good morning from Winter Park, just up the road from me. All right. Oh, Morocco. Man. Awesome. Federer. Thanks for tuning in from Morocco. All right. So I'm not saying I'm not, you know, going to do shoe reviews, but I am. I am. I'm back. I'm back. But, um, it's just not as high on my priority list. Okay. That's all. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying here. Adidas. I like saying it the European way. These are the, oh, yeah. Oh, this is an old school shoe at this point. Boston 12. There you go. Fascinating. Always fascinating. How much does shoe, how much does shoes and shoe reviews light your fire? Like, does it like light your fire? And that's okay. Like, please, just be honest, be truthful. I was truthful with you just 30 seconds ago. It doesn't light my fire as much as other things. And that's okay. Does it light your fire? Let us know. All right. Just be honest here. That's all we that's all we do here in DGR. All right, come on. This is this is uh this is I gotta I gotta refuel cashews. This is gonna be a this is gonna be a this is gonna be a long live stream. This is, we're gonna set a record today. Um let's see. Good morning, Scott. Here we are. I know. It was so fun to meet Rena, Scott. Send her my best. It was wild. A wild, wild day, Scott. Out in Sacramento. Okay. GGR gear lights my fire. Yeah. Christina, you are awesome. So Christina, I mean, she just she's she's rocking it. She's got her gear in uh, Hong Kong, and um, we got some new new mugs. All right, everybody, little lily pad green. Don't mind if I do. And we got some more. Actually, well, I'll just tell you guys because we're live. We're here. We're we're working together toward our goals. Um, I'm hopping an airplane next week to go visit a um a producer a distributor of hopefully our winter running gear okay so i'm gonna hop on an airplane and we're developing our winter running gear for dtr right now 
and but it just takes time to find the right people to work with. It really it took me quite a while to find this company, but I'm hopping in an airplane next week too. So I appreciate you, Christina, always supporting. Okay, there we go. Uh huh. Okay. I see. Boom. Oh yeah. See, yeah. Oh my goodness. Mock X. Mock X. Old school at this point. Old school at this point, but very zesty. Very zesty. It's so interesting how like every Hoka upper has that same kind of feel to it. So there you go. Here's a good question that I'm going to ask everybody. Okay. What? Because, okay. We have a lot of people watching. Thank you. Almost 150. So there's millions. It feels like millions. When I started shoe reviews, it felt like there was a handful. But now it feels like there's millions of YouTubers doing running shoe reviews. And for me, like... I like to be different. I like to do different. When everyone is zigging, I like to zag. So you could go watch shoe reviews all day long on YouTube, running shoe reviews. Um, and so I guess, like, why not just go watch them? Why watch me? And I the reason I ask that is, like, what do you like about my style of running shoe reviews? And that will help me uh, figure out and decide, okay, let's lean into these components of my running shoe reviews that actually helps people. Oh, we broke 150. Thanks for spreading the word about the live stream. So does that make sense? Like, why, why, why watch my reviews? Why not just go watch everybody else's? Because there's millions of people doing them. And it just gets, for me, a little tiring on YouTube. Some YouTubers that I used to watch and now all they do is shoe reviews. And I'm like, uh, 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 it's like, I, I don't need to watch another shoe review. You know what I mean? Uh, it's, they're saying the same thing over and over. So I don't want to be that person. And that's what happened in Sacramento. Everybody came up a lot, you know, it felt like at least a hundred people came up to me and said, Seth, I appreciate what you're doing on YouTube, but the reason we watch is because you, really they said because you're family and like you're not just running you're not just running shoe reviews you're not just talking about watches or whatever like you actually are a human person like you're you're real with us and so um and that was really reassuring that we're on the right path with this channel but i'm just like trying to discern the shoe reviews moving forward because i realized they do bring value for you and I, so that's great. And I'm willing to do them and I want, I will do them, but, um, I am coming back just so you know, two shoe reviews, but I just want to make sure that I'm not saying the same thing that all the other millions, <laughs> I'm saying millions, but it really does feel like all these other shoe people are kind of making the same videos. And I'm like, ah, I'd, I'd like to do it differently if that makes sense. All right. So your, your, your feedback, um, your feedback would be appreciated, if you know what I mean. All right. Okay. Those were the mock X's. Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Um. Okay. Let's take uh, take that off the screen. Okay. Now, Josh. Appreciate you, Josh. Let everybody read that. I'll read it here in a second. Josh, read media. Okay, and if I, I'm sorry, if I missed a comment or a question, um, I'm, I'm, this is kind of a little bit of multitasking. Um, this is fun. This is fun. New normal. Um, yes, indeed. See, this, this box arrived, and I actually did see it arrive because I could set, I could see the outside, and I didn't even, um, didn't even open it. It's like for me, it just. It didn't. It didn't light my fire, but that's. But we got it now. Yeah, this is their new. Um, their new shoe from the summer time with Vibram, Vibram on the outsole, the Kajarg. Kaj this is old school at this point, but there you go. Okay. Very interesting shoe box design. Okay. All 
right. Uh huh. Let's go. Okay. So Josh says, your shoe reviews are by far the best on the interwebs. Change my running game with your advice and structured reviews. It's your use of running cutaways and honest feelings for each shoe. Nice. See, that's good. That's good feedback right there, Josh. I love that. Christina says, hold on. We love your variety. Good. Peter says, unless you get really unstable ankles, your reviews aren't going to be that useful to me. I love seeing your slice of life rather than a shoe review. Yep. Peter, you the man. Miss you, Peter. Thanks for being here. Christian, what's going on? Good to see you. Mm, let's see. Piano Man says, most either aren't as descriptive or are highly based toward a specific type of shoe. If it's not plush, it's not good. Interesting. Good to know. Um, Brent says, I get excited about shoes because until the Nova Blast 2, I could never run 10 miles without my feet hurting for days. So now I watch shoe reviews to learn the tech. Your style was really unique. Oh, thank you. And David says, I do like the way you break down the shoes for sure, but the, the main reason I watch maybe a matrix every so often is the way you can hit multiple shoes in one go. These Those breakdowns are great. Thank you, David. Keep the feedback coming, everybody. I do appreciate that. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Oh, this is fun. Clifton 8 GTX. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Looking zesty. That's fun because uh, snow is on the way. That's very fun. Clifton 8 GTX. Okay. Very cool. Um, good morning, Jeremy. See you in Discord. Amber says, haha, seen that Mach X old or not? And I'm like, hey, now, I'd still run in it. What size is Seth? Man, seven, seven, seven and a half. What does that translate into? I think my shoe size translates to a nine in women. Amber, let me know. I can get you some shoes. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. They're still good shoes. I will run in these shoes. Trust me. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Wow. Phantasm 2 from Solomon. Phantasm 2. Okay. Now, I, I, I'm gonna I'm gonna call it as it is, everybody. And I said this a couple weeks ago, and I don't want to sound ungrateful. I don't want to sound ungrateful, okay? And I'll get to some more comments here in a second. Um, but I also want to just be honest and always transparent. And I'll never forget my roots. Remember, I couldn't afford running shoes five or six years ago, new running shoes. So I went to Facebook Marketplace. You all know the story. That's the shoe that is on the wall in the studio. I'm pointing, it's right over there. So I don't want to sound ungrateful, but just keep in mind, these shoes, you know, literally cost nothing to be sent to me or to any running shoe YouTuber. And so um, it's free marketing for them. We're not getting paid to make these videos. And these videos cost a lot of money to make, as I broke down last week. So it's, you know... Yeah, you get free shoes, you get content, but it's like, at the end of the day, um, it is smart marketing on their part to send all these shoes. For example, I have them here right now, and I'm talking about them for free, you know, for all of you. So it's, it's um, I, I understand why they do it, and it's smart on their part, but that's kind of the game that is played with these huge you know, sometimes multi-billion dollar companies around the world, like the big ones, you know? And so it's a, it's just a balance, just walking that balance between the, the, the influencer running kind of creator space, you know? And um, trust me, I'm grateful, but at the end of the day, it's just not what is at the highest priority list for me. Active chassis, wow. DRX Bliss. 
a from Solomon. This is a, a stability shoe from Solomon. Very interesting. Very interesting. Okay. Okay, we're getting the pile is stacking up there. Okay. Um, oh yeah, Ultra Three, Ultra Three V Two. I'm actually kind of excited about that one. I will. Um, I'll be running in that through the winter. Very exciting from Solomon. Okay. Boom. You guys see the, the pile is, is coming up there. All right. Oh my goodness. And if I don't run in if I don't run in these, I will give them away. You know, I I won't be able to run in all these because I took six months off. Um, the Aero Volt. Okay, we'll give those away because I actually already reviewed those. Like, actually, I reviewed those I think six or seven months ago. Um, and then this is the Thunder. Oh, wait a minute. This, oh, the Thunder Cross. Okay. See, I'm out of, I don't even know what this shoe is about. The Thunder Cross from Solomon. Very good. So you guys, you guys can teach me what shoes um, are on the marketplace. And I've, I can't say I've ever heard of that shoe before. All right. Very good. That was a good box. Um, Sam says the Matrix is super helpful. Very good, Sam. Um, Darwin says, I followed you, Seth, because of New York City 2019 marathon and shoe reviews. I really love your shoe reviews. Bring it back, especially the shoe matrix. Yeah. Um, um, Logic Cycling, a good mix up is one to shoe reviews a week would be good, especially for interesting shoes like the Speed 4. I don't trust the other reviews, to be honest, because they just read the marketing material. Very interesting. Okay. Good to know. Um, oh my goodness, Peter in the house. Come on, Peter. Peter just became a member of the channel. Oh, oh, hold on, Peter. Hold on. Hold on. Thank you, Peter, for becoming a member of the channel. Thank you. Thank you, Peter. I had to do the cowbell a little quieter because everyone is still sleeping in the house. So, Peter, you demand. Thank you, sir. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, hop over to Discord. You know, that's where we have a really good time. Um, okay, let's go. Mm -hmm -hmm. All right, Eric, thanks for tuning in, Eric. Do appreciate you, Eric. Go get that run in. Enjoy, enjoy. Mm -hmm -hmm. Okay, so. Mm -hmm -hmm. Uh, will you attend the TRE, TRE next year in Austin? I have no idea. I have no idea. If it works in the schedule, I'd love to. But um, it's just never worked for me with family life and uh, racing this year, CIM. So that would be it would be fun. I would love to go someday, someday. Okay. okay. Again, it's just like not high on my priority list, but I, I, I would go. I would go. Okay. Now let's see. Oh my goodness. Wow. That's nice. I guess I didn't know this was on its way. Maybe I did. Ugh. Again, I didn't I did not order this, but um, free marketing. So you guys know Soar. Oh my goodness. Soar makes really good product. <laughs> but nobody can afford it. <laughs> you know what? I I would never I would never buy Soar. Um it's it's great product. I, I think they're on the right path. I just think their price point is uh, a little zesty for me. Actually, it's it's uh, it's really zesty for me. But there you go. Soar, soar, soar. All right, you guys know this company by now. They're doing good things. Don't get me wrong, but it's just like it's just a lot. Um, it's a it's it's uh, it's actually it's I don't even know what to say about the, about the price points at this point, but. That's okay. Okay, very good. Okay. All right. Uh -huh. Boom. Okay. Ugh. Oh, yeah. Okay. Cloud Boom Echo. Cloud Boom Echo. Boom. From On. Very cool. I mean, I'm listen, I'm not... I'm okay with on. Like I think on is also moving in the right direction. Like watch out for him. So there you go. On Cloud Boom Echo Three. I believe this is the third edition. Very nice. I like I like that color. 
Okay, yeah. Okay, oh my goodness. How are we doing out there? You guys getting tired yet? I'm getting tired. Bring back the shoe reviews, please. <laughs> I know. And um, you guys know that I have a partnership with Running Warehouse, like most of the other running shoe YouTubers. In fact, that's another thing. When I started doing shoe reviews, I was one of the partners, you know, Ginger Runner was. Anyway, they also they have a lot more partners now. And so, you know, it does help the channel. I'll be just frank with you. Like, if you buy the shoes that are on DemoreGlobalRunning.com, not DemoreStore.com, but DemoreGlobalRunning.com, um, it does help. You know, we get a kickback from Running Warehouse when you buy shoes through Running Warehouse through our links. It does help, you know, for sure. And Running Warehouse is very smart to have these partnerships with running YouTubers. Um, so bringing back the shoe reviews, um, you know, bringing back the shoe reviews, um, and happy birthday to your husband, bringing back the shoe reviews. I'm willing to bring back the shoe reviews, but I'll be honest, like I would also appreciate if you bought your shoes through running warehouse through our links. Okay. That will help make more videos that will help. Uh, everything that we're doing in DGR. I'm just calling it as it is. You know, the lights don't turn on um, because the wind is blowing. The lights turn on because we're working hard, if you know what I mean. All right, and happy birthday to your husband. We might have a birthday emoji somewhere. Oh, I don't know if it's in here, actually, Anne. I do apologize. But anyway, happy birthday to Anne's husband. Nice. That's great. Uh, we'll have to uh, sing a a virtual uh, happy birthday for him. There you go. We'll smile for him. Um, let's go. Okay, I'm trying to get to as many as possible. Um, yeah, Scott, that's a good... There you go. I did try the Speed 4s, Eduardo. Yes, I did. Feels like a speed. It feels like a speed yes it does uh -huh. Uh -huh. oh yeah nice 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 very nice super comp v2 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 super comp very cool um i ran a lot in the v1 this summer i ran a lot in it there you go v v2 that's cool that is cool so, so good. Okay. I'm very sore. I'm very sore. Speaking of which, very sore. And so, but I'm excited to get back into, oh, water bottles. That's nice. Very nice. Okay. Light the fires, crack the tires. Okay, we are we're making progress, but um, we're still going. So, good morning, good morning. If you're just tuning in, we are having a good old time here. A huge unboxing moment. Um, bringing back shoes. Um, bringing back shoes, and I'm gonna do shoe reviews. I am. I promise. I'm gonna do shoe reviews, but. Um, yeah, I'm back. I'm back. I think I listen. I'm. I think a lot of people don't trust me, and um, when I say I'm coming back, and you know, it took it took a couple months post Pike's Peak to come back to making videos, to making vlogs, and it's okay. Like I get it. Like I'm a stranger on the internet. There's no reason you should put your 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 complete trust in me. But I'm. I promise you, I'm. I'm coming back. I'm co even to the shoe reviews. Like getting through CIM, like there's only 24 hours in a day. We're launching our own gear line. All right. These are boxes right here that I have to take to the post office here in a, about an hour or two, I guess. It's, it's not open yet. Um, and I don't know what to tell you, like the amount of work it's taken to launch our own gear lineup. And so I, I'll just commend you for being patient with me like those that have remained patient um 
I, I thank you, but I'm here for you. And I'm like I said a couple days ago, I'm getting ready for 2033. I, I hope I'm not doing shoe reviews in 2033. I hope somebody on my team or maybe my kids, if they want to do, you know, it's like I want to pass the baton on to somebody else at some point. But for now, I will continue to do the shoe reviews because, I, again, I know it brings value to all of you. Um, but everything takes time. And I think a lot of people thought I was done and over, but I'm not. I'm just getting started. We're in the top of the second inning for everybody that loves baseball. Top of the second. No no, no reason to rush, everybody. Oh, my goodness. Thank you all for just tuning in. Oh, my goodness. This is a long live stream because I talk too much. All right, here we go. Come on now. Happy birthday to Rena. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Rena. Happy birthday to you. There you go, Scott. There you go. That's my best rendition. Um, let's see. I liked your shoe reviews because they are very analytical and not just fuzzy feelings. There you go. Love it. Um, let's go. Hello from North Wales. Very cool, James. Appreciate you. Wales. Love Wales. Love Wales. Okay. Onward and upward. And yes, keep the questions coming. Um, keep the questions coming. Okay. So here we go. Okay. Okay. Whoop. There we go. Ooh, oh, my mind. Oh. Uh-huh. Oh, my, my. Oh, my, my. We already opened this. Okay. We got a lot of repeats here. Okay. We'll give those away. Okay. That was a that was the uh, stability shoe from Solomon. Okay. Uh-huh. Do-do-do. Whoa. Do-do-do-do-do-do. Man. Man, oh, hold on, there we go. Headphone came out for a second there, okay, so, uh-huh. Oh, that's fun, wow. When I started doing shoe reviews, I remember, I think I did the three, the Audios three. You guys remember that shoe? Here's the Audios eight, very cool. That actually looks pretty interesting to me. Wow, who owns the Audios eight, okay? I remember the three, and I was like, I don't know, I, was, I wasn't too excited. That was like one of the f earlier shoe reviews I ever did. Anyway, there's the Adios 8. Very, very cool. Thank you, Adidas, for sending that. Okay. Whew. Oh, my, my. Hey, hey, hey. We're getting, um, we're getting uh, surrounded here. Hello, Russell. Thanks. Um, Lamb Sauce. Hey, Seth, what do you think is better? The, pr the prop... Propel V4 or the Rebel V3? Mm. Oh, that's interesting. Well, I don't know. Kind of a little bit of a different shoe. I I love the Rebel because it forces me to be in charge of the shoe. Uh, my ankle especially. like, And I like that feeling when I'm pushing off. Whereas the Propel... you, But I, I like the Propel a lot, actually. Just so you know. But kind of different... Um, definitely different foot strike. Like the Propel will help you more, whereas the Rebel, you kind of you got to focus, and and I like that feeling. Um, under step is where I'm mentally engaged with my biomechanics, specifically like ankle and below, and that's what the Rebel does for me. And that's since the V1. Oh man, guys, I'm not saying I. I'm saying this in jest, but I just just got. I'm not saying I, I saved the rebel, the mo. <laughs> do you guys do you guys remember the Mach three from Hoka and how bad it was? And then I got the Mach four, and somehow I got the Mach four early before a lot of other shoe people on the internet. I don't know how many shoes I sold, how many Mach fours I sold, but I sold a lot. Hoka. You're welcome. You are well. Same with the Nova Blast One. 
I'm telling you, everybody, ASICs, you're welcome. And kind of the rebel, okay? New Balance, you're, I'm telling you guys, the amount of publicity and buzz after I publish those videos, especially the Mach 4. Hoka, you're welcome. Okay. Because see, back in the day, there weren't a million running YouTubers doing shoe reviews, and so it was just different back in the day. Ugh. Let's see. Did it go? Nope. Okay. Got to get aggressive here. Hold on. Hold on. Get it? There we go. Okay. Uh huh. Oh, is this the Tecton? Hold on. What is this? No. What is this? E no. Oh, the Zinal. Nice. Very cool. Very cool. Okay. Zinal two. Zinal two. Zinal two. Zinal two. I like it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. That is very, very cool. Xenol 2 in the house. Come on now. Come on now. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Very zesty. Very, very zesty. Okay. We're making headway. Just having a good old time. Cheers. Coffee and shoes. Don't mind if I do. Maybe we should... Um, Maybe we should start a new series called the um, Coffee and Shoes Crew. Coffee and Shoes in the Morning Crew. All right. All right. Thank you all for tuning in. Um, I'm, I need more coffee, though, and it's upstairs. Oh, that's sad. Sad moment. Hello from Oxford. Graham. Come on, Graham. Boom. Let's get a little cowbell for Graham. Boom. That is amazing, Ben. Listen to this. I still have a pair of Mach 4s with life in it based on your recommendation. That is epic, Ben. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I sold so many Machs, but the Mach 3 was horrible. It was the worst. It was a horrible shoot, the Mach 3. But the 4, they changed it. Oh, butter to the bread. Okay. We are, we are not done, <laughs> Like I said, if you need to take the kids to school and come back, we'll probably still be here. Okay. What is going on here? Okay. Oh, my goodness. There might have been a little miscommunication from Solomon. Okay. That was the Thundercross again. Whoa. Hmm. What is this? Whoa. Holy guacamole. Whoa. Oh my goodness. Whoa. Talk about a chunker. This is called a, a girth monster. The Float X. What is... I, I'll be frank. I'm not too... Skyline Float X. See, again, I'm, I'm just, I don't watch running shoe reviews on the internet or read about them because I want them, I want my gut reaction. I want my, so I actually, I don't, I, I don't know what this is. Look at that. This is a chunker, everybody. Is anybody familiar with this shoe? If so, feel free to help me out. Okay. How we doing? You everyone okay? Anyone need a coffee? Donut? All right. Jeremy still here? Jeremy, you need a donut? Um, I had a donut yesterday. Um, are you still resting or maybe a nice walk today? Yes, Mike. Um, oh, man, a walk today. I did not walk yesterday like a real walk. I might be able to walk today. It's pretty ugly. Um, I am going to go to the grocery store, and so I'll walk around the grocery store. But it was – I have never been this sore. I'm, I'm telling you. I don't think I've ever I don't think I've ever been this sore. I I'm just trying to re reflect. 
it's wild, Mike. And every like, I, I I was not ready for the rollers. I was not ready. And it's it's so much different than mountain running because it's first of all it's fast, but it's the downhill pavement. And maybe I was braking too much. I don't know. It was it was my first kind of downhill marathon, even though it's not all it's it's rolly and then Mike. I I literally like there's <laughs> There's moments where I have to lift my leg. It's I can't even describe to you, Mike, and everybody how sore I am. But that's okay. I, I think by tomorrow I'll start to feel real good. Oh, Heather, love you, Heather. Thanks for tuning in, Heather. I picked a great time to go on my lunch break. Coffee and shoes for the win. What's up? Good to see you. Um, Peter must need the donut for sure. Come on now. I'll airmail you one via drone. Uh. Padre, that's epic. Good to see you. We're just hanging out as as we do in the studio. Good to see you. Oh man, up uh dark and early, right? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So fun. Too too much fun. Okay, Cole says high schooler training for the Bandera 50k. Whoa, any training tips and racing shoe suggestions? I currently train in the Nova Blast 3, Rebel V3 and Speed Goat 5. Nice. That's a good lineup. Man, oh my goodness. Well, maybe the one I just opened, the Zanal, too. That one looked pretty cool as far as a racing shoe. That looked pretty zesty right there. The Zanal, t- yeah, here it is. Um, in case you're just joining us, Cole. This feels really lightweight. I haven't ran in it yet. Um, it does have a booty style collar there around the ankle. And, uh, uh, but that light base Vibram mega grip, like it's looking pretty intriguing. And I think it would be enough midsole for a 50 K. So, um, that just like is an idea that just hit me Cole. Um, so thanks for tuning in, uh, and high schooler, man, going for it. I like your style. sir. any training tips and racing shoe suggestions, training tips. Oh my man, you know, me and. 50k is oh boy my last 50k was ugly so um yeah i think um oh my goodness you know i i'm not, i'm probably not going to get into it cole cuz that's a big like too too much um it depends on the terrain you know i would say practice the terrain <laughs> kind of like cim in california you know i wish i would have found the rollers somewhere here in the greater denver area like just rolly but the thing with CIM is like the rollers go on for 13 miles. I just, there, there is just not a road in Colorado, at least that like rolls like that. It just, la, 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 la. anyway, so Cole, mimic the course in your training. Okay. So whatever course you're doing, oh, Bandera. Um, so I'm not too familiar with the course, but try and mimic. If you can get out on the course, all the better. So anyway, Cole. Congrats, man. Going for it. Appreciate you being here, sir. Um, okay, here we go. Okay, we are actually making progress. Okay. Okay, I think I already know what this is. Ugh. This is, yes. This is the, the girth monster as well. This is getting a lot of buzz right now. The girth monster. All right, the cloud eclipse from on. You guys see that there? I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued. Let's. Just, oh, should we do the thumb test? Oh, let's. should we? Should we do a little loosey goosey? Come on. Did you guys miss that? Did you? Did you miss it? Did you miss it? Okay. Not too much. All right. One dead goose on the screen. Okay. Let's do the thumb test here. Oh. Oh yeah. Nice. Okay. What about in the heat? Oh my. Okay. Okay, okay. It's got some give to it, everybody. Very good. I don't have the durometer right here, but all right, let's put this uh let's put this up there. Okay. Um Okay. That's fine. Okay. Okay. Whew. How we doing everybody? Um all right, Brent says, who else is getting nervous about the Chicago lottery tomorrow? So I will be in Chicago, everybody. Let's have a, let's go. We're going to have a party in Chicago in October. Okay, Brent, let's go. Oh, so today is Berlin and tomorrow is Chicago. Like, that's awesome. I didn't realize uh, Berlin was today. And somebody said, like, they're waiting, like, 
right now. It's like the drawing is any minute, it sounds like. So I don't know. I don't know. In fact, are there any Berlin updates since we went live an hour and 15 minutes ago? Does anybody have updates on Berlin? You know what? We should have, ooh, should we have a Chicago lottery watch party tomorrow? What time is the uh, is the lottery, Brent? And is it like one time or is it like a emails, probably just a bunch of emails go out? That's what I do like about uh, the Western States 100, like their lottery. It's just fun. You know what I mean? It's just like a fun atmosphere when they draw. Um, okay. And Amber's here. Come on, come on. Uh, definitely anxious about the Chicago lottery. Um, Heather says lots of people nervous for the Berlin lottery, me included. Oh, there you go. Okay. Uh, Max effort to get up and down. Did you see that? Did you see that, Drew? Drew, you, you're paying attention. Uh, Heather says Berlin Marathon official Facebook page posted 45 minutes ago telling us to be patient. Yikes. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't help. Um uh, Daniel says emails go out throughout the day. Oh, that's too bad. You mean for Chicago? That's too bad. Um, okay. So I heard the Chicago lottery emails go out at 8 a.m. sharp. Oh, now 8 a.m. maybe central time is my guess. So what would that, would that be 7 a.m. my time? Yeah. I mean, I'll research that. That would be fun. Oh, wouldn't that be fun? Okay. All right. All right. Here we go. This is a this is a pretty serious box. Oh. 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 See, <laughs> I I hope I'm still in your good graces. I hope I, I I'm in your graces, all right? I gave a little bit of a tough honest score for I think it was the 3 and things got a little silent on the front. Of ASICs. I don't know what happened. If they were not too pleased with my ASICs Nova Blast 3 review. Um, but I just call it as it is in the studio. If I don't like a shoe as much as the previous iteration, I'm just going to say it. Go buy the previous iteration and save some money in the process. The Nova Blast 1 and Nova Blast 2, I much preferred over the 3. Um, I think the 3, and listen, some people love the 3. But for me, it just got a little too, a little too bulky, a little too girthy, and um, so it is what it is. But anyway, thank you, Asics, for bringing them back. All right, but this is not the Nova Blast. See, I might still not be in their grace. This is Magic Speed Three. Okay, thank you. Uh huh. Wow, that looks pretty fun. That looks quite fun. Nice upper, interesting upper. Nice, nice, nice. All right, so there's the Magic. I know. I realize these shoes are like old school at this point, but. Um, okay, and then this is a Jero Cayeno 30. Oh, nice. Very cool. Very cool. Little, uh, a little, uh, stability action there for all of you. Very nice. Okay, 4D guidance system. Okay. Man, it's fun. Listen, I know I'm not like, I'm not a shoe guy. It's just not my thing, but it is kind of fun to you know, go back to our roots, our DGR roots. We have had a lot of fun together in the old studio. 170 people watching, by the way, on a Wednesday morning. Huh? Can we crack 200 on this fine morning? All right. Thanks for hitting that like button. I appreciate it. Oh, man. So it's like we, we've been through a lot. You know, if you can remember when you found this channel, and I will say a lot of people found this channel because of shoe reviews. They're looking on the interwebs, and I pop up, which is amazing. Thank you, thank you. And if you remember the shoe that you discovered this channel through, let us know in the chat or in the comments below, because I I get it. Like, people, you know, people are looking. They're looking for shoes and what shoes to buy, and it's a, it's a, it's a vast... Uh, jungle out there in the running shoe space, as you can as you can see, there's a lot of options. I don't even know. Uh, there's just so many options; it's overwhelming. So, I um, shoe reviews are coming back, as I keep saying over and over again in this live stream. And um, I just, um, yeah, shoe reviews are coming back. I just needed to open them first. Um, 
we'll get the research going. I'll get the testing going once I can walk again, and then um, and then we'll we'll let it rip. Okay, and don't forget, I will also be publishing some shoe reviews exclusively just on DemoreGlobalRunning.com. Um, so like a blog, not just video. All right. So don't forget that either. Um, okay. When you really like a shoe, your joy is contagious. That's great. Um, David says Berlin still crickets. Okay. 49 co kebab, kebab here, uh, register for Berlin half marathon, trying to break 75 minutes. Let's go. That's awesome. Um, mm hmm. Okay. Endorphin Speed 1. Yes, there you go. So Matt found the channel through the Speed 1. Oh my goodness. That's another shoe that I we sold a lot of Endorphin Speed 1s. <laughs> Matt, that's pretty epic. Uh, Matt Brent says Nova Blast 2 on my third pair and two more brand new in the closet. See, exactly. I love it. I love it. I love it. Brent Mm, mwah. that's how you live everybody you find the shoe and then you just stock it in the stock it in the closet all right that's what i'm talking about maria says you taught me how to tie my shoes correctly i'm embarrassed to say that's awesome <laughs> that's great oh my goodness that's so great is uh padre still watching all right there we go maria that is great okay arahai four um uh, Brent also put 531 miles on the Glide Ride 3. Wow, that's epic. Yeah, oh, the Glide Ride built like a tank, everybody. Um, okay, let's see. Mm -hmm. Just a couple more. Okay, had it for a few months. Okay, okay. Whew. Okay. I think we're nearing the end. I think we're nearing the end. Oh, so heavy. Okay. Okay. Radio silence, really bad. Uh, this is really not uh, not how you do radio. Mm, okay. Okay. I think those are under embargo, so we're gonna. I'm sorry for the radio silence. I'm just trying to trying to open and process here. Interesting. Okay. Bottom line. I basically have these are all I think some of these I could show you, but some of them I'm not supposed to show you, so uh you know. It's like whatever, you know. We're We'll follow the rules this time. Okay. Yeah, interesting. Okay. Um, these are all Sauconies, by the way. So, there's some some rules out there. I did break one the other day. Okay. That's a pile of cardboard behind me right there. Oh, man, our poor... Oh, wow. Oh, my. Oh, my. I'm not supposed to show you all these, so sorry. 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 Oh, Sockany. What are we going to do with you? Oh, top of the morning. I think we did it. We did it. Whew. Okay. So, if you're just joining us, Good morning. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're alive and kicking and enjoying this fine morning and waking up 
and um, we just unboxed a lot and um, shoe reviews are coming back and running is fun shoes are fun um, but at the end of the day it's it's the joy and the purpose driven gift of running to get out the door in the morning whatever shoe you're running in don't matter actually in the end in the end it's the it's the purpose driven life that um, is just fun to have a go which is hard after a peak race like CIM because I can't go run right now a because I can't feel my legs and B I'd need to take a break even though I want to go run especially to test these shoes for all of you um, but it's just gonna have to be a few more hot minutes okay so as I've been saying over and over and over again these last really six months thank you for your patience we're in the top of the second inning on on YouTube we're in the top of the second inning that's it all right I'm not going anywhere I know some people thought I was I was done or that um, I had moved on from running and shoes and all that but um, just the uh, the the art of patience and we're back though Okay, and this is a big step, actually, just getting these shoes open. Um, actually, here's here's some of the pile. <laughs> okay, getting these shoes open and uh, out the door for all of you. That was fun. Okay, let's just see here. Uh, where's the coffee? I know, the coffee is empty. And you see that? We got a new coffee mug, all right? A, li a nice light green, kind of like a, a nice spring green. Oh, these will be going on the store very, very soon, everybody. Um, I'm all out, and that means I need to go upstairs and get more. So, um, let's see. Da, 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 da. Girth Monster is what... Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I'm not going to read that. <laughs> um, hi, everyone. And Seth, up early this morning. Nice to catch a live stream. Philippe, good morning, Philippe. Hope you're doing well. Always good to see you. I think I found you because of the Speed Cross 5. That's so great, Greg. That's great. The uh, the Big Bad Wolves, right? The Big Bad Wolves, Greg. That is too cool. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> Cutting open shoes with a bandsaw. That was a good... Those are some good vlogs, everybody. Um, okay. Time to wake the kids up for school. Have a great day, Amber. You as well. Enjoy, enjoy your day. Thank you, Amber, for everything you do for DGR. And uh, Suhaidi, super late joining the party. That's okay. We just opened up shoes for the last uh, almost hour and a half, and it was a good time, and we're getting them back and going. Uh, Daniel, good morning. Michael, uh, I love your channel for everything you do, not just shoe reviews. I know, Michael. That's what it's about, you know? So much more to life than um, shoe reviews, that's for sure. And even running, crazily enough. As much as we all love running, there is more to life than running. And so I try to share uh, more than just running here on the channel. And a lot of people uh, affirmed that out in Sacramento when I was out there. They said, keep going with the vlogs and your style and sharing the family life. And so that's um, that's what I'm going to do. That is what I'm going to do. Okay. Well, <laughs> oh, I appreciate it, Michael. I do appreciate that. Um, yeah, it helps. This is the bottom line. It just helps the channel, helps make the content, and, um, and especially as the new shoe reviews come out. So stay tuned. Once I can feel my legs, we'll get back out there to testing shoes for all of you. Okay. <laughs> only the Lord only knows. The Lord only knows. More marathons or more kids in 2024. The Lord only knows. Tris Christian. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in. Glad you're back. I was waiting like a kid, waiting on their dog to return. <laughs> that's hilarious fat and ginger runner i love it very good um okay scott the run after rest is the best what shoe will be your first run this week oh that's a good question oh man um i know man i'm just looking around um you know maybe that clifton 9 gtx who knows that kind of caught my eye um Clifton 9 GTX perhaps, but uh, so, so good. So 
Have a great day. Any last questions? Get them in now. Sneak them in as you can. And um, it's mo- it's it's Monday. It's Wednesday. I want to start running as soon as possible, but I probably won't run this week. I need to just let the legs recover. Um, it's hard to be patient, but I'm going to be patient and catch up on some other things. And bottom line, thank you all for being you, for tuning in. And um, if you're watching this on replay, I appreciate you uh, watching the replay as well. Lots of um, lots of uh, shoes today. Christina, my half marathon is in 11 days from now and still have to do more 5Ks. Any advice, Seth? Oh, my goodness. Well, 11 days is not too, too much time, so don't work too, too hard. Save the legs for race day. But... Um, you know, I like some good little turnover workouts, like, you know, a little ladder, 200, 400, 800, um, and then back down. And if you feel ambitious, you could go maybe one time up again. But just to get some turnover in the legs, you know, if you can find a track, that would be good. But um, 11 days, it's a little, getting a little close to race day. So you don't want to, you don't want to work too, too hard. But congrats and excited for you let us know how it goes for a metal monday for those that don't know we are now doing metal mondays if i can find it there it is so every monday this past monday i was traveling but every monday we celebrate your races around the world okay so email me info at demoreglobalrunning.com your race photos your race report and yes of course the shoes that you raced in, and then I'm a little behind right now, but basically we, we try to put, for example, something like this, yeah, like Dominic raced the New York City Marathon, so we did a little shout out for Dominic, and he gave a little explanation as to how the race went, okay, so that's Metal Mondays, Metal Mondays, M-E-D-A-L, <laughs> not, not Metal, Metal Mondays, all right, Metal Mondays, <laughs> rocking out in the studio. Hello from Luxembourg. Hello, JJ. Um, uh, Brent says, Seth, for Running Warehouse, does it need to be the link or do you get credit if we use your discount codes? No, it needs to be the link, Brent. It needs to be the link. And you can, so if you use the links below the vlogs, um, and there are not as many there now, but if you enter as long as you enter Running Warehouse through one of those links, whatever you purchase, we do get a kickback from Running Warehouse, which helps me make more videos for all of you. So, but you have to like demoreglobalrunning.com, go click on any of those links on the website and then um, we get a kickback. So, um, thank you because these videos, this equipment, it just doesn't happen, you know, out of the pie in the sky, if you know what I mean. Uh, Too bad uh, video equipment doesn't grow on trees. Yes, indeed. Luxembourg, man. I love Luxembourg. I've been to Luxembourg. Luxembourg, beautiful little country there. Okay. Um, All right. Onward and upward, unless there's anything else. Um, You know, Graham, it it, it does and it, it does, yes. Europe's been hard to, it's been kind of hard to, to, yes, it does, but, um, man, more updates on that soon, Graham. I appreciate you asking. I really do, but I'll just say it's been a little hard to work with the European version of Running Warehouse, but we're, we're working on that side of it, Graham. So, um, more updates on that very, very soon. I appreciate you asking though. Graham, okay. And onward we go. Um, have a great Wednesday. Yes, Scott, I've seen you a lot this week, and that is okay with me. Scott was at CIM at the group run. Um, have a great week. Hope to see you in Chicago. Let's go, Chicago. All right. Let's get, spread the word, everybody. If you live in Chicago, it's going down. We're going to have a good time in Chicago. October 14th. Actually, I'm looking at my calendar. Yeah, or maybe October 12th and 13th. Is that right? Um, so I think the group run will be on October 12th, just so you know, I'm looking at the calendar on my wall right now. Um, mm, I'll probably fly out on the 11th. I think the big boys are going to come with me. Um, I don't, I'm not 
sure yet on True Love, but I think um, definitely the big boys will come, and then um, it's just going to be a good old time. So, and let us know, um, yeah, let us know uh, about Chicago for the dr- for the lottery. All right, onward and upward. Have a great day, and we will see you guys soon. Seek beauty, work hard, and love each other. See you soon. Tomorrow, maybe tomorrow, tomorrow. Chicago lottery. All right, ciao.